back to our channel. In the video, kulla po mna di ningo nu nama channel la subscribe panna na maraka ma subscribe pani konge. Wang video kulla po lam. And this video, we are going to uh, tell you about the logic of today's question, how to do it. So I am going to share my code snippet with you. So but you might not get the actual output, but you might get the output. So you need to make some changes in my code and to get the final output. So if you get the uh, code uh, in your uh, correctly, just put it in the comment section. But I will show you my code snippet also. So let us understand what the question they have given is. The question is multi-story car parking lot okay so what we must do is we must accept a integer matrix of size r cross c okay which represents a multi-story car parking lot okay and the integer zero represent an empty slot and one represents a car you just thinking of your mind like this it's a slot so one represent there is a car park and zero represent this empty slot okay then the entry point is always present as the bottom right okay the entry point is always present at the bottom right of the ground floor the way to reach the first floor is on the left side of the ground floor okay it's on the left side of the ground floor the way to reach the first floor is on the left side of the ground floor the way to reach second floor is the right side of the first floor so it's a similar follow a zigzag way like that similarly the ways of remaining uh, floors are present on the left and right side alternatively okay a person wants to park his car in the first occurring slot or above the x floor the value of x is also passed as the input and we must print the instruction he need to follow the park is car as the output that is l followed by integer k which indicates that he needs to move k slots towards left and similarly r which is more towards right and u that means it we should go to the next slot okay so this is the input you can see here the x value is given three so first occurring empty slot on the third floor okay and the third floor is like this you can see the third floor is here this is the first occurring so we must start from here and coming here and coming here and coming here and coming here this is the first one this zero is the first one okay so the instruction to park in the car is like this okay l7 then u then r7 then u the l7 then r that like three okay one two three like that so he we must print like this as the output okay so now let me show you my code okay this is a my code which i have used here so this is the one working code but you need to make some little changes to get the actual output okay so instead i have created a function here find parking instruction with the values matrix r c and x and the instruction and the column position direction will be minus one and here looping through the floor uh that is the r minus one x minus one and minus one and similarly for column in range if matrix of the floor is equal to zero then the empty slot will be equal to the column and here using the break statement and similarly the move steps is the absolute value of the column position minus the empty slot and here using the conditional statement and finally we are returning the instructions okay and finally we are getting the r and c map in matrix and x value as the input from the user and finally we are printing the instructions okay so this is the output which i have got for this input so this is actually wrong so you should get some other input like this you need to get uh, this as the input but in this code you might need to change some changes to get the actual output okay so that is for today this is the main logic of today's program and if you complete it by yeah uh, and just put in the comment section so we will get notified and let me note that so keep pushing keep trying don't lose your hope okay guys i will see in the next video thank you for watching this one